Uh, was I not supposed to do that? If I wasn't, then... What's your excuse for smelling so good? You're not food. Strange. I would have thought that you were food. Judging by how much I want to eat you. Do you know who I am? Sometimes I... You're talking to me, but... I'm not so good at that. I'm hungry. Are you going to get me some food? I thought... Maybe since you smelled so nice... Maybe you'd have a snack on you. I'd like that. Do I really sound sleepy? It's not that, it's just... You're... Like a tasty treat. I feel like I've gone to the restaurant and eaten a few full-course meals. Maybe it's a talent of yours because you make me feel full at least a little bit. Full on something I can't explain. But I want to eat you. Nah. You're reminding me of one of my favorite snacks. It's called goldfish. The snack that smiles back. <laughs> Did I bite too hard? I thought kisses were for testing how tasty someone was. Was I wrong with that? Don't worry. I won't eat you up right now. Hmm? Am I not supposed to pick you up? I thought it'd suit you to be carried in my arms. I like the feeling of feeling full, and I get that from your company. So, why? Don't we go and eat something together? But more than that, I was hoping I could get to know you. It's not something I usually get to do. I'm not the best when it's not eating. But I'd like to take care of those I care about. And you give me a good feeling. You give me a very good feeling. I like it. You seem like the best person to take as a dinner guest. Is that wrong of me? Do you not want to? You're smiling. Did you eat something nice today? Ah, uh, you are smiling because of me. Is that right? <laughs> I could snuggle you for quite some time, but I'd get hungry and then I might eat you, not whole or anything, but I might get too hungry. I may seem like I'm some kind of bad guy, and maybe I am. It's hard for me to say, to judge my actions. But I, I am not the best when it comes to what the past was like. I'm sorry. That's not something I should be saying. Not some 
thing that's rolled up in here. And this is my favorite. My favorite spot. Mm. Sorry if I was too forward in bringing you here. I just thought someone as tasty as you would want to try food as delicious as they are. Sorry if I was confusing. I'm trying to share something nice with you, but I'm not entirely sure if it's what you desire. You're the human, aren't you? The human mm. meant my brothers. I wonder what do you think of me? Have I been too impulsive in bringing you here and kissing you? I just thought maybe you'd want some I'm with me. I'm not so great with words, expressing myself, and I like simple things, though I might be too simple some days. I made lots of mistakes, lots of things I regret that It's nothing. You shouldn't worry about someone you just met, silly. And I'm not sure why I said it. But I told you. I'll be fine. This isn't the first time I've struggled. But your hug did make things better. I enjoyed it. And I'm happy that you're here. Would you like a bite? Second hand kiss? What's that? Should I be concerned with that? Huh. You seem awfully red. Should I get closer? What I'm doing, I'm checking your temperature. You seem to be acting funny. You're quite warm. Mm. Could this be from that kiss earlier? Mm. Is it wrong to kiss someone that you think you like? Perhaps I could steal your fever away. Was that not right? It seems to have gotten worse. Perhaps I need to think, find a different approach. Food. Maybe you haven't been eating properly. Here, that, say, Ah. Uh, I thought it might be easier for you to get food by a kiss. I thought maybe that way I could give you something to focus on. You seem like you needed it. Is everything all right? You seem so warm. It's addictive. I sometimes get cold hands. But with you, it doesn't feel that way. 
It feels like I can just relax and eat my snack. And what's that? You're saying that, but... What is it you're trying to get at? I'm the reason you're feverish? Did I get you sick? Huh. I sure hope not. That wasn't my intention at all. Oh, you mean like that? I've never felt like that for someone. But when I talk to you, it feels like I'm just a bit more full. Do you enjoy it? This feeling together, the togetherness we have. If it is what it is, are you happy I took you here? Would you like a snack? <clears throat> I would like to understand how you're full. What makes you fall? That You've had expression. You've had an encounter with me. That was all you could handle? I see. So that's how it is. <laughs> I'd like to eat your heart. Not in the way you think. I'd like to consume all those feelings and understand you better. I'd like to find out what flavor you are deep down. Am I too excitable? Sometimes I think perhaps I might be. I think about it, I look in the mirror, and I wonder what's for dinner. Mm. Sometimes you look appetizing like a 50 course meal, do you know that? What does it all mean, I'm not sure, and yet when I'm with you, I do feel full. And so I'll choose to make this a happy time. What makes you happy? Mm. <laughs> I could just hug you like this. Just like this. Is that too much? Am I too much? I've never relied on someone like this. Mostly because I don't think I have a right to. I like this. The comfort of a hug, it's very filling. When I hold you in my arms, I feel like there's another part of me that's full with feelings. Mm. Yeah, you, you feel like a delicious meal. Is that normal? Am I appetizing to you? Huh, is that so? I'm not sure. Is this more than I can chew? This feeling? of not wanting to let you down. <laughs> but the fact that you enjoy food too is more than enough for me. Some part of me, when I get to be with you, it's not so bad 
having some room in my stomach. I... I'm glad that things transpired like they did today. I'm glad I could meet you. I'm also glad that you don't think I'm too weird. I know deep down I'm probably a strange one, thinking with my stomach. Sometimes people get the wrong idea about me, that I hunger and thirst all the time. But really, I think there's emptiness. It can't be filled with just food. Maybe it's you I've been looking for all this time. Wait. Did you eat my custard? Tell me. Tell me now. I can smell it on your breath. It wasn't you. You promise. Then... I'll trust you. But nobody, and I mean nobody, gets between me and my custard. Are you surprised by how I am? Sorry for falsely accusing you, for pushing you against the wall. I didn't mean to seem especially mean. It's just custard. It's like chocolate or vanilla dreams. You can't get better than it. It's one of my favorite things. <laughs> Even if you did eat it, I think I'd forgive you. <laughs> it's because you've been kind to me. Maybe I'll get you a custard sometime. And maybe then we can have another excuse to spend a day like this. Does that sound nice? Yeah. <laughs> you surprise me sometimes when I'm not sure how to view you. You always clarify it. That you're a good person. That I can trust you. I like it. I want more of you. You're just like Custard. Mm. And sweet is it. Even if you're more on the salty side. was just making sure I could decide which one I like the taste better of. You or custard. Why are you laughing? This is maybe not serious, but it's serious to me. Do you see me as someone you can trust? I don't know if I can accept that trust, though. Not with who I am. The people I've let down. I'm not mature enough for that. Even if I seem like I'm like my brothers, I try and look out for them, but I always get a stomachache whenever I talk about these subjects. If it's all the same to you, you can pretend I didn't say anything. Oh, and I'll let you go from the wall to my bedroom. Isn't it nicer here? See, you can see everything. And there's food as far as the eye can see. I organized it to be nice and neat. So whenever I want a snack, I don't have to waste time or calories looking for it. <laughs> you know, maybe I could use a few more brand. 
I'm being a little hungry while holding on to you like this. It's not so bad. Not bad at all. I'm happy in my own way. Do I confuse you? Am I strange? I... I hope not. Oh, I have to wonder who ate my custard. It's a strange disappearing act. This happens a lot. If you didn't know. <laughs> Sorry, it's just that look on your face. It reminded me of something. Nothing I could tell you, but I guess you'll have to guess. Not many people seem to see me as much of a person to talk to, but I'm honest with how I feel, and... When I meet someone that I believe is a good person, I want them to be near. They make me feel less empty. I think that's why a lot of people think I'm just a childish nobody. It's because as much as I try, as much as I make myself be honest with others. They don't always want to hug. They don't always want to eat with you. And well, food can solve almost any problem. It can always make people like you. I let someone down a long time ago. It was one of the worst things. And ever since, there's been this distance. I feel like I'm to blame. Even if nobody says it, the way they look at me, it's just not the same. I shouldn't be even talking about it, but I did. I can't take it back. My mistake cost someone everything. I blame myself because it was on me. Everything was on me. I don't expect you to understand what I'm talking about. In fact, I'd be more surprised if you did. But I... I'm glad you're such a good listener. I'm certainly not the best at talking. In some ways, I feel like talking to you has made the emptiness feel a little bit better. A little less empty. Though my stomach it's been rumbling this whole time. I guess you make me hungry again. Oh, I'm not sure why. When I get hungry with you, all I want to do is pick you up again and kiss you. <laughs> Am I wrong? Did you not enjoy... My taking you here has it at least been somewhat nice. <laughs> I feel so relieved to hear that you like it here. You can have all the snacks you want. If I leave little gifts for you, would that be all right? Could I hug you sometimes and tell you how I feel? It's something 
I'm not sure how else to say. I'm sorry, but you're sweet, and I want to have another taste. You're as addictive as custard, and that part of it makes me really wonder what I'm going to do with you. <laughs> I need to be careful, or I'll get just as addicted, but isn't it okay? <laughs> Can't I kiss you again? <laughs> I mean it when I said I want to eat your heart. No. I told you, I want to understand you, I'll have you as my own, if that's what you want, I'm not exactly sure what it is you do want, but if I could give it to you, I would, no, I will. May I hold your hand? Yes. It would mean a lot to me. Particularly because I... I feel like I... can be full if I hold you. It does feel... nice. A wonderful full feeling. Where I feel like I can be alive. Where I feel like I can be something else. Better than I know I am. Will you be mine? I swear to share my custards with you. I thought maybe... Maybe I could be someone special to you. But maybe you'd want to spend a lot more time with me. Maybe next time we could go to your room instead. That maybe you could show me your favorite food. And I could show you mine. We could treat it like a sort of dinner date. Would you like that? Are you sure? Is that really okay? I don't know if I'll be good enough, but I'll try to be. I'll try and be a full course meal to you. I'll try and give you something more than my brothers. Normally, I try and help them. But this time is different. I want you all to myself. I want you to be mine. So I'll make you mine. If that's what you want. Hmm. I could hold your hand for as long as you want. But I think I'd rather taste you again. The sweet and salty taste of your skin. Your lips against mine. Surely delicious. Holding you close. It's not what I expected it to be. I am completely satisfied. And yet not at all. I want more, more. I want to taste your heart, served a la mode. <laughs> Won't you share it with me? The beautiful flavor, delicacy, everything. Your 
candied lips. I like them and want them nearby. May I hold you? Hold you in my arms. Ah. I feel excited and scared. All at once. Is it bad? I think you might be my favorite meal. Would you hate me if I said I loved you? Perhaps the kiss was to prevent your answer. Or perhaps it was to beckon it out. I couldn't say. My mind is too numb from your flavor. Kissing you. I get drowned in it. The feeling of having you in my arms this close. I can't hunger for anything more than to hold you for longer than to make you more mine, to make you more tasty. You're anything but a snack. If you had to be one, I'm sure you'd be a full course meal. Because your heart, that's so perfectly seasoned, as well as your skin, your lips, your everything. I could devour your time, day, in and day out. I could stand to waste forever with you and might even forget my own sin of gluttony no failure. I'm not my past, not just my past. I'm proud to be Beelzebub even if I need to learn what it means to be more than hungry, do you? Enjoy our time together. Is it really okay? I sure hope so. Would you mind if I took a nap with you right here? Now, just like that, somehow, it's like you're the cream filling to my Boston cream donut, and I'm the outer layer, cooked to perfection, and that's why you fit so well in my arm, that's why we're great food partners. I am thankful that you came here.